What? What? <laughs> Rhea, mm. there's a guy with a pineapple on his head standing right next to you. Yep. And if that's not weird enough, it's a guy with a pineapple on his head standing right next to you who is also a living palm tree. Pretty cool. <laughs> what do you think about that? I think... The person who carved this had a lot of fun doing it and didn't kill his tree. And then he also gave it a number, probably for his kid. I think that's the date. It's September 5th, 2009. No, 2005. So they did this tw uh, 15 years ago. And so, I mean, how cool is that? So like living palm tree, you go and make a sculpture out of. I've seen people do this to dead trees after they cut them down, but not perfectly alive trees. So that could just show how much abuse these plants can take. And uh, so, and it's not just this tree. I'm not sure who did this, but look, 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 we got it. I don't, I don't know if they're home. They're really, <laughs> I can almost see it from this. I'm just gonna take a liberty here. Just take a liberty. If they come out and shoot me. Well, you know, I had a good life. There's another pineapple there. Super beautiful. Um, it's like the same year. It's, it's, yeah, it's, they're all the same year, 2005. Here's another one. Same pineapple. Here's one right here that, uh, that really shows because it's right in the sunlight. But anyway, it just goes to show that you can create some beautiful carvings into your queen palm. I'm not going to be the one to do that because I probably won't be good at it since I don't have much practice. You could also carve a flower into your queen palm. That's really pretty. Um, and you know, I am a sucker for avocados. That looks like a bacon to me. I'm not sure exactly which varieties that is, but, but, uh, but anyway, the whole point is that these palms can not only provide shade and vertical accentuation and wonderful sound, you can have your tiki god you like that? Yeah. All right. Time to go home? Yep. All right.